One of the most popular lunch items is soup. I see soup and sandwiches or soup and salads on almost every menu around town. When we make soup at home, it seems to make a lot. So I have a solution. Check it out. It seems like every type of cuisine around the world has a signature soup, and there are so many types of soup: hot, cold, clear, hearty. Soups also freeze well. So the next time you make your favorite soup, but you get burnt out on it before it's all gone, freeze it. Here's my top hacks to freezing soup. Number one: If you want to freeze soup and servings, use the red Solo cup. Put one serving into the cup and freeze. Once they're frozen, you can extract from the cup easily and put it in a freezer bag. Now you just have to thaw one serving at a time. Number two: Just use canning jars. You just fill up with soup, leaving about an inch at the top for expansion and freeze. The quart-sized jar is about two servings, and the jars fit nicely into the door of the freezer. Number three, pasta gets mushy when you reheat it in the soup. So, if you make soups with pasta, a great idea is freeze the soup base before adding the pasta. Add the pasta to the amount of soup you know you're going to eat at that time, and that way you're not getting mushy pasta. You can freeze a minestrone soup with all the ingredients except for the pasta, and it will reheat beautifully. And just add pasta. Number four, making a hearty soup like chili. Put the leftover chili in a muffin pan. Freeze and then pop out the frozen cups of chili and put it into freezer bags. Now you have a perfect chili serving ready to heat. These are great ways to prep for the week as well. It's easy to grab a serving of soup in your on your way out of the door. These are great snacks for kids after school. They're healthy, good for you. Just grab a serving and reheat. Enjoy making your soups with less waste. Now, if you know of someone who needs help with a purchase or refi, we promise to take great care of them, just like we will you. Your referral is the biggest compliment you can give. Thanks for watching. Have a great week, and I look forward to talking to you.